All right, we're here in this rainy morning at the home of Josh and Courtney Kayser. Courtney's my admin assistant at Momentum. And, uh, but we're not here to primarily see them. We're actually here to meet two other residents. Momentum, I want to introduce you to Vaughn Kayser, who is just barely over one week old. Look at this little dude, yes. His middle names are Emmanuel, Harrison, and then obviously Kayser is his last name. And we always liked Vaughn Harrison Kayser, but then we really wanted to do something like with our faith. Mm -hmm. So we chose Emmanuel, which means awesome. God with us. All right, so as excited as we are to meet Vaughn, uh, there's actually another member of the household that we've come to meet. So Annette is our, well, probably more so mine than Josh's um, <laughs> ball python. What do you think about the python? Um, I'm not a big fan of the python. So how did you how did you come up with the name Arnett? A friend gave her to me, and they named the snake Arnold after um, Schwarzenegger. Arnold Schwarzenegger. For real? Yeah, That's yeah, yeah. Awesome. After... Look at my python. <laughs> Get to the chopper. I'm like 95% sure she's a female. So I took the name Arnold, and I'm like, what can I make Arnold that is? Uh, what can I take from Arnold that sounds like a girl name? And uh, that's how we got the name Arnett. So ball pythons are actually called royal pythons also. Yeah. And that's because in Africa, rulers would essentially wear them as jewelry. And I got to thinking about that. I was like, dude, I'm kind of the lead minister at Momentum, and that's kind of a big deal. And I'm also a rapper, and so I like necklaces. So would it be cool if I tried to hold her? Yeah. This would be awesome. Well, hey, Satan, pretty little devil, Beelzebub, prince of demons. I think she's trying to tell me something. I'm not sure what she's saying. What? Okay. Man, how'd you do that? It's crazy. I'm surprised Courtney didn't take a bite first though. Coming soon at Quicken Loans Arena, Motley Crue the final tour, and guest appearance by Alice Cooper. All right, this is pretty sweet. Courtney uh, is gonna feed the snake, and so they usually feed it a rat, um, but the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles came and saved the rat because they thought it was their sensei. But we actually couldn't find a rat at a local pet store, so they got a gerbil, which is smaller than what it actually usually eats. Uh, but this is pretty sweet. We're gonna get to see a feeding, so if you, are a, you have a weak stomach, this is probably a good time to go to the bathroom. Usually what they do is they will strike the prey and then they'll wrap around it. And um, as the rat is taking its last breaths, it just constricts it and basically crushes the bones and the lungs so that they can't breathe anymore. And then they will start eating the rat. Usually it's from the head to the tail. What they can do is they unhinge their jaws to swallow the prey. Um, so whenever she's eating, You'll see when you look at her now, her, her jaw and her throat are pretty small and pretty narrow, um, but they can actually get to the, they can grow to the size of the widest part of her body. And you'll notice when she's like swallowing the prey, her jaw will actually unhinge and get really large to accommodate the rat or the rodent that she's eating. It's a boring pet. It's super creepy and <laughs> it might eat you one day. <laughs> say no to pets that will eat you. Peace, Momentum.